you know, it's uh, about 22 months since Jason left. Mm -hmm. And it, it's been a pretty long journey to get to <coughs> this right. very moment right here. And so, um, by the luck of the draw, you're the first guy into the door. I'm kind of like the guinea pig. You know? <laughs> <I'm> like... <laughs> Please don't worry about modesty because I think it's important that we know what do you think you could bring to the band? Well, like I was saying, I, mean, I was talking to Lars, and uh, as far as like the performance angle of things, you know, that's all there. Right after the Ozfest, I was out with Zach Wilde's band, Black Label Society. And we did two weeks. We did uh, 11 shows in 14 days. We only had hotel room two days in two weeks, and uh, maybe uh, three showers in the two weeks. So it was rough. That's not right. But you know, and then I, I had two overnight equipment drives on the equipment truck. You know what I mean? So like, from going from the private jets and playing in front of 30 to 40 thousand people, you know, for the. Ozfest, and then going to the extreme opposite end of the spectrum, I endure the punishment from that end too. And it doesn't matter to me, I just enjoy playing. And uh, creatively, I enjoy cr contributing into a, a, a creative process, you know what I mean? I like to, as a bass player, I think it's exciting and it's, it's fun. And it's supposed to be fun, right? So That's what it's all about. Yeah. It has not been fun sometimes for us in the past. Yeah, yeah. But, you know. It's, it seems like you guys are having fun now. You know yeah. what I mean? I mean, just from yeah. what I'm hearing and everything. And, you know. I mean, it's been fun o other albums, for sure, but right. this is the first time it's been a real pleasure. What about the... Um, some people do better being involved with different projects, all, you know, like, as opposed to one family. Where are you in your life in terms of wanting to be a part of something on a permanent basis versus being wanted at wanting to do lots of different projects? Well, I think it's important if you're involved in something on a permanent basis and there's that connection and uh, it's, uh, you know, that's really special. Yeah, exactly. I guess in some way I feel kind of protective when you ask Rob a question like you ask. I, I, I just feel, I feel that I felt that question had an agenda to it. Yeah, the agenda was to just to find out what he was thinking. I don't know, and maybe, you know, I just, I'm, I'm touchy in that area. You know, I just, I, I, you know, if I was sitting here with us, I would want to be as comfortable as possible. And I guess I, I have this oversensitive thing about making people in my space feel as comfortable as possible. Thank yeah. you, Fred. I mean, I think it depends on what Larry, again, we always go back to what the motive is, you know, and if we, I can look at my motive. My motive is uh, not about protecting or not protecting, it's about giving Rob and the band the best shot at understanding each other. It might bring everybody to a greater um, clarity.